hear the watch is having trouble holding the side streets. Bunch of chew. Good, good. And your niece, Callista, isn't it? I'm very concerned about her. She'll be found. My men are searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hole up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. Time for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass all the quicker. Locked. One of the servants must have been in here. Let me see. It seems I have the wrong one. Not that one. No. Ah, here we are. Now if you'll join me. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained, big time. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. What a... Who's been in here? I owe you an apology, Captain. This is hardly the hospitality I planned for you. Well, time to do this the hard way. What was that, Campbell? Never mind. It's a stroke of luck for you, Captain. I'm forced to break out the real vintage. Leave the men here, or we'll have to share with all of them. <laughs> Very well, Campbell. As long as we get this little dispute settled.
Joseph, help! Damn it! Where'd he go? Firing! Die, damn it! Whiskey for a week, you kill it! those fools at Coldridge for letting Corvo get away. Who knows what the man could do now? High Remel, the Lord Regent, as he asks us to call him now, seems to have faith. All the Sokolov security devices he's put up all over the city, but I'm not so sure. At least the girl has been moved to a safe place. Visiting her twice a week has given me ample opportunity to inspect the facilities, as they say. So there's an upside, at least. If he comes back, I'll earn another promotion. Would have got 
not so bad if that damn fool Corvo hadn't killed the Empress. Out. We got someone skulking around. I'll write to her again. She has to see reason. Let's just see what happens if I get another crack at this guy. Restrict the wandering eyes that look hither and yonder for some flashing thing that easily catches a man's fancy in one moment. But we are laughing at a My sister! She's not a witch! I know her! Out of the way! You expect preferential treatment just because you are her brother? She will burn! All witches must burn! Bertolt, don't let them take me! I swear I've done nothing wrong! Silence your lying tongue, foul witch! Guard! To me! Go! Come on, bleed! Going down. You appeared as if from nowhere. We would both be dead if not for you. We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I must get my sister to safety. But first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Take what you want, and good luck.
things are bad. Could the city get any worse? completely fine. Fine? Look at you. You have the plague. You are trying to conceal it from us, your brothers in the Order. Was that your intent? To spread the malady to us? No, friend. I tell you, I am well. <laughs> as fit as ever. Put down your weapons. Just think for a moment before you... <laughs> He was sick. Very, very sick. That much I'm sure of. Now to find some way to dispose of the body without spreading his illness. Corvo, it's Samuel. I'm here. From the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. Lock and Lord Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect I'll want to congratulate you.
he's alive. Thank you, Corvo, thank you. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons, but I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. They're all corrupt. If this is going to work, we have to take down the Lord Regent and all of his key allies. You know that. Yes. Hopefully the High Overseer is the first step along that path. And we must find a girl. Emily. Poor thing. Who knows what her mind is like being there when her mother was killed. I'd imagine the daughter of an Empress is tougher than you think. Hmm. Quite right. In any case, we won't get the Lord Regent until we weaken his base. All the pieces are in play. He controls the City Watch. Through Campbell, he had the religious faction. Someone is funding the military. And he currently has a majority in Parliament. Yes, I'm aware of that. My brothers control the voting block for my family. I'm very much aware of that. You did it! Somehow you took down the High Overseer Campbell against the odds. I knew you were our man, Corvo. With Campbell gone, we've hurt the Lord Regent immeasurably. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself in Dunwall Tower. Yes, and Campbell's journal, let's not forget. Our hope is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Our entire movement will mean nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal her, to step out as the hero and further cement his regency. If he doesn't bring the young lady forth soon, there will be infighting among the nobles as to who should succeed the Empress. Yes, time is against us. But now you should take a well-earned rest, Corvo. We will decipher the contents of the High Overseer's journal and share them with later. 